what's going on everybody come back we're going to do a real quick video on the model 49 marlin show you how to take the trigger pack out okay guys um real quick i'm going to show you how to take the trigger pack out of 49, model 49 marlin um if you don't have the wheeler uh, screwdriver set that's cool just make sure you get a good uh, good bite on the flathead. Usually these are not too bad with a standard screwdriver, but you know, if you've got the tools, the right tools, then use them. This screw looks kind of janky from the get go. And to be honest with you, a little narrower screw or screw head. Okay. I found the right screw, or I think I found the right driver bit. I didn't realize how many flathead bits there were until I got a Wheeler screwdriver set. <laughs> so anyway, let me um, let me take a crack at this. And I know it's just these two screws that brings the trigger pack out, so hang on just a second. Okay, so I was correct. It's just the two screws that hold the whole trigger pack in. Uh, there's the trigger pack itself and all other first thing I got to tell you you have to do before you remove the trigger pack is to open up your feeder tube your feeding tube you have to open it up and pull the rod out because it locks into the trigger pack so it don't lift up so all right and there's what the trigger pack looks like on a marlin 49 so you can see. Now, if I remember correctly, to get that, to get the uh, uh, bolt and everything out, you really got to push hard on that rod, that spring right there, especially if you're replacing the spring. You got to be careful. You'll bend that spring all to pieces. Um, I put a new one in this gun because it was messed up already. It was weak. Uh, so I put a new one in it. Now, here's another clue. If I'm not mistaken, look it up before you do it. But if you need to replace the spring, a Model 62 Marlin is the same spring. So there you go. But basically, you just drop your trigger pack back down in. I believe. I don't think there's anything special you have to do. I could be wrong. Hmm. Give me just a minute because I may have to pull I may have to pull something out and take a look. Okay, I was wrong. There's nothing special you have to do. It's just the way you slide it in there. There's a little spring tension, but I think it's between the hammer. But if you just I did a second ago, now I can get the Yeah, there we go. Just press down and she goes right back in. Um I don't know what the fellow was asking about as far as if there's anything special you have to do, but I'm not, I don't think there is. Um, let me check one more thing before I put it back together. So that way, if I, he has any more questions, we're good to go. Okay, two things. One thing to remember, there is a short screw. As you can see in my hand right there. Let me do it this way. That's a short screw. And there is a long screw. The long screw goes in the rear, short screw in the front. Always, when I take uh, screws out of guns like this, when I'm tearing them down for the first time, I always try to lay the parts like this screw I laid here, this screw I laid over here, just so you could see, you know, which screw went where. So we drop that screw down. To where it holds it. I don't tighten them yet. Um, if you put Loctite on these things, use blue Loctite so you can get it back out. If you use red, you may never get that back out again. So anyway, this short simple. I'm keeping this in a Thursday video on how to take trigger pack out of a Marlin Model 49. Hope that helps the gentleman out. Thanks for the content. <laughs>
But anyway, I haven't had this gun out in a long time. And then you just put your rod back in. Let's see. Put the rod back in. There it goes. And she's ready to go shoot again. Model 49. We hadn't had this one out in a while. Hadn't had it out. 22s have been kind of, you know, just haven't been firing them. All right, guys. That's it. Short, simple video. Hope that helps. Um, the fellow out that asked me about it. There she is. I keep these in um, those socks in my safe so they stay clean. There's no rust on the barrel. Barrel looks really good. It's been in there. I haven't shot this gun in probably... Ooh. I bet it's been three years since we've shot this thing. Been since the 22 scare started. When it started and we stopped shooting them. Saving ammo. Alright guys. That's it. Be prepared.